Dustin, according to my uh, calculations, you are a third generation Chuck Wagon competitor. What is it about this this sport that has got your family hooked in? I don't know. You know, uh, it's just one of those things we love. You know, there's uh, grandpa started it all, and now uh, there's the three of us on the tour here, and I uh, got a couple cousins on the CPCA tour. So, yeah. You know, that's all we talk about. That's all we know. And uh, Christmas Day at supper time, we know we're going to be talking horses and what we're going to hook in Medicine Hat on Thursday night. And, you yeah. know, that's that's what we grew up in. We're fortunate enough. Or we're spoiled to be, uh, to call this a job or a career. And uh, we enjoy it. Do you guys run it like a team or are you really independent with your with your wagons and with everything about it? Because you, know, uh, you know, you know what I mean. Like in some sports, like like uh, auto racing, for example, there are certain teams that they they run things very like with teamwork. But then uh, there's others run it very separately. We're we're separate. Uh, my barn is my barn, and Dad's barn and Logan's barn are separate. Uh, if we got to sneak over and help hand uh, hooking or borrow a horse, uh, we do. But other than that, it's kind of separate. You take care of your baby, um, and that way, if something goes wrong, it's all on yourself. Yeah. Taking care of the horses, though, making sure that their needs are fed, they're met, and everything else. That is that is one of the most crucial parts of this whole sport, though, isn't it? Yeah, when I come back in my next life, I'm going to come back as a chuck wagon horse. Oh, yeah? uh, they're <laughs> as spoiled as could be. They get everything they want at any times. Um, they eat before us. They they always come first. And yeah. uh, at every point, we're always looking, well, what can we do to, to make them more comfortable or, or better for them? And I can speak for all 36 guys on the tour, and everybody's the same way. Dustin Gorse through the WPCA joining us here. I'd imagine that, that I mean, you're not a, you're almost a vet, I'd imagine, with all the things you need to know about those horses to keep them healthy or whatnot. Or, or does the tour have a vet that comes along everywhere? Uh, no, you're, you can sneak over and uh, grab the odd question here and there. But, you know, the, the 14 years or 13 years before this year of outriding really helped. Uh, you, you get to pick on things, what you want to do, what you like. And then uh, finally, when I made the jump, uh, I kind of had to set in my mind how I was going to do it and how I wanted to prepare myself. I noticed on your Twitter account, you're big into horse racing. What did you think of American Pharaoh this past weekend? That was pretty cool. I yeah. never thought I'd ever see that in my lifetime, to tell you the truth. You Triple know, you're crown. getting out 37 years. Um, and it was pretty cool to see him cross the finish line. He was yeah. out for a Sunday jog. He had his ears up. And that's pretty cool. I know. Mm-hmm.